Coming on the heels of its 70th anniversary, Guinness Nigeria PLC holds its 2020 annual general meeting but in strict adherence to the COVID-19 guidelines. Straight to the business of the day is the Independent Auditor's Report and the report of the Statutory Audit Committee. We are satisfactory. According to the company, the poor macroeconomic situation and the COVID-19 pandemic had a significant impact on the performance of the company in the year under review. The board and management have introduced innovative strategies to engender growth despite the challenging operating environment and put your company on a sound footing for the future. I am confident that the strategies being adopted by board and management we have the desired impact by improving shareholders' return in the years to come. The financial year end results indicate that from 131 billion naira generated in 2019, the revenue decreased by 21% to 104.37 billion naira. The company saw a loss after tax of 12.57 billion naira compared to a profit of 5.48 billion naira in 2019. Operating loss for the year came in at 12.83 billion naira when put side by side of operating profit of 8.96 billion naira in 2019. Earnings per share grew by 330% to 574 kobo in 2020. Although the company did not declare any dividend as a result of the business performance attributed to the COVID-19 pandemic, Guinness Nigeria PLC says it's committed to delivering sustained value to its shareholders. Our intention is that we go back to the tradition of regularly paying uh, stakeholders their dividends. And we do believe that uh, as soon as you know, performance begins coming back and the crisis goes away, we should be getting back to what we do normally, paying the dividends. Yeah. Most of the provisions are regulatory induced provision which means that with time, the, that those provisions can be written back to buoy the profit and loss account of the company to create for a bigger dividend for us. The year ended 2020 appeared to have been a challenging one for the company, but the board and management remain confident of the future.